Hi guys, welcome to Redefined Gospel YouTube channel where we are thriving in Christ. This channel seeks to link the word of God to the contemporary times and ultimately ensure that we are thriving in Christ. So in case you're new here and this is the very first time you're coming, uh, kindly hit on the subscribe button. I create content around faith, law and personal development. So if you're interested in that kind of content, either of the three or all of the three or two of the three, uh, kindly do subscribe. If you are returning to you clearly, clearly enjoy my content, kindly do subscribe. Um, it is Christmas Day when you're seeing this and actually it's Christmas Day while I'm shooting this. I am doing a little packing here and there um, for a short Christmas holiday that I'm taking. Uh, but I thought I, I must have a video up. I think I've just done three, two vlogs to Christmas and I'm intending to do at least nine at this point. <laughs> at least nine. So I am going to actually shoot this, edit this on my way and make sure it is uploaded by today so that you guys can see this and it is a christmas tag so i intended to do this christmas tag as i'm packing but i realized the angles and everything and i'm already late then i could as well just do a very quick sit down video welcome to vlogmas day 4 <laughs> on christmas day <laughs> vlogmas but 12 vlogs to christmas day So I'm going to answer these questions and this is a way of, after this I'm going to wish you a Merry Christmas but I just want to remind you guys that the reason for the season is Jesus Christ, that he was sent by God, God sent his only begotten son so that then he may come on earth and that we may have eternal life and he is the reason of the, for the season. So whatever way you're celebrating Christmas, however you're doing it, kindly do remember that Jesus is the reason for the season i just have a total of um, 12 questions actually 12 loves to christmas 12 questions that i'm going to answer real quick and then we wrap up this video i want you to be like short and sweet <laughs> so the very first question is what is your favorite christmas tradition i think for me my favorite christmas tradition is traveling whether it's traveling to a country whether it's traveling to a place or he's traveling to a hotel i think that's my favorite christmas tradition um yeah and growing up actually my favorite was because my grandparents live those sides of nakuru uh actually stopping by a place called dalamea and having some smokies some yogurt some dalamea yogurt i mean that was a favorite for me and it was something that i was always looking forward to for christmas so yeah that's my favorite christmas tradition number two where do you spend your Christmas? I think for me, I don't have a specific place. Sometimes it's at home. Sometimes it's on Avake. Um, sometimes it's at my grandparents' house. So I don't have a specific place where I spend my Christmas. So yeah, I don't have a particular place where I can say, oh, here is where I spend my Christmas. Third one is, what is your favorite song? <laughs> my favorite song is Feliz Navidad. Mm -mm. Feliz Navidad, eh, eh, eh. Feliz Navidad, doo, 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 doo. mostly because I massacre <laughs> that song. But yeah, that's yeah. It makes me feel like it's Christmas. Feliz Navidad, yeah, yeah. And there's this other one for on the first day of Christmas. <laughs> this whole time i thought i was using my red mic so i hope the audio has been good so far i really hope so um so the other one is do you decorate before or after thanksgiving i have never decorated for christmas i think this will be one of the most boring christmas tag i'm not saying oh i normally decorate after thanksgiving because or before thanksgiving so then i can create the mood for thanksgiving i have never done that thing <laughs> i've never done thanksgiving um i think it's something i should do next year actually next year i'm planning to decorate so maybe in next year's vlogmas videos there will be decoration <laughs> decorate with me <laughs> we never decorate i mean it's the typical african uh, christmas home <laughs> um the other one is tinsel or garland i'll just say garland but i've never used either of the two but i think i just viewing it from like the malls and stuff like that i love the garland if you don't know what the garland is i'll put an image here. and going by the fact that okay and going by the fact that I'm editing this on the material day, if I don't get it, guys, I'll write here. Google it. <laughs> um, the other one is, what are you most excited to see this Christmas season? Hmm. 
not really to see uh, but you know this christmas season becomes at a, a, a time where um, i reflect a lot it comes at the end of the year and for me this particular day is a is a day of reflecting about my salvation because i believe in christ i believe that god brought his only begotten son and that he died for our sins and because of that i'm born again and I believe in him. It's a time of reflection, reflecting my relationship with God. Uh, so I don't have a particular thing that I am particularly interested to see. But when I'm traveling, I am um, interested to see the place. <laughs> when I'm going to visit a family, then I'm excited to see other members of my extended family. Yeah. The other one is, do you own an ugly Christmas sweater? Does this pass? <laughs> <laughs> to be a, an ugly christmas sweater does it guys does it i don't know but i don't have but we can use this actually it's green and i normally see when people are wearing christmas sweaters it's a it's a, it is either red or green so yeah maybe which one christmas food you cannot live without chicken i, I have to eat chicken <laughs> on christmas day whether i'm spending it in the house or um up country or in a hotel cuckoo chicken <laughs> is a christmas food i can't do without chapo not really cuckoo <laughs> yeah uh, peppermint or gin gingerbread i've not had any of either of these of course this is more westernized kind of christmas tag questions have you ever tried a fruitcake yes i don't know how that relates to christmas but yes i've tried a fruitcake then what is one thing you asked for this christmas <sighs> i'm not asked for anything and i don't know if it's a material thing because i am not you know in a home or i've not grown in a culture of you know gifting during the christmas day or christmas season maybe it's something i'll adopt in future but i think for this christmas i what i'm asking for um and it just goes in line with what i am looking forward uh to see or it goes in line with that question of what I am most excited to see this Christmas season and it really is um just I ask for a renewal of my salvation and just as I reflect that I'm excited or what, what is the question again I'm asking that in this Christmas season I will shape up or I will you know outline how i'm going to grow my relationship with christ going forward i think that is one of the things that i'm intentional about this christmas season and this christmas day actually to reflect on that so whether i'm traveling or not that i will be in that space of actively thinking about it because you guys i fell behind a lot of things and i'm going to discuss in a later video towards the end of these 12 vlogs to christmas and you will see and those are things that i really need to think through a lot the other one is if you could be a christmas movie character what will who would you be you guys maybe home alone that guy but <laughs> yesterday night which is christmas eve i watched a niger christmas on netflix and guys <laughs> i would be who i would be that lady that uh the church lady like you imagine this church lady was asked out by a guy and then um he knew like the guy was not really interested in her and was not really interested in in church things but he was pretending to be interested in church things and then this this lady takes the guy <laughs> takes the guy to a prayer kesha overnight and this guy thought actually they were going out because they said there's this event and it will be overnight and stuff like that. You're the shock in him when people were praying in tongues. <laughs> I'll be that girl. <laughs> wow, that was really hilarious. It was really hilarious. And I don't know if my excitement is seeing it's the morning and I slept really late watching that movie, An Aja Christmas. If you're in a position to kindly do watch that video, yeah. Yeah, so that's the end of the 12 questions of uh the christmas tag i hope you have enjoyed and i would really love to know your answers down below um whether you relate with either of the three what are you most excited for this season what are you looking forward to see and what does this season mean to you i'd really love to hear from your comment section kindly remember to give this video a thumbs up kindly subscribe if you have not and um yeah share this video share share because sharing is caring and once you share on instagram or twitter kindly do tag me at njorogean254 and that will be it for 
today's video see you tomorrow for day five of the 12 vlogs too and after christmas okay remember as always that god loves you a lot bye bye